Hi guys, welcome back to Dion the Flicks. I'm um, just going to do a little quick review of a movie I watched last night called Alex Strange Love. Um, to start off, it is a comedy movie. It's a Netflix original. And I was watching Arrow and Flash and I just needed a break from a TV show. And this came up so I watched it. So to start off by saying... I'll get my little synopsis. It's about a guy named Alex, true love. And basically, he was just honestly trying to find love, quote unquote, his last name. And after some time of getting a best friend, his best friend became a girlfriend. I'm not ruining any spoilers. You're going to get this in like in the first two to three minutes. And so they became boyfriend and girlfriend. And since they're in high school, they're going to graduate school and they're applying to colleges. Wow, this is starting to sound like um candy jar. A little bit. So um, as time goes on, they he wants to lose his virginity to his girlfriend and he wants to go about it but he meets a new friend so his girlfriend's name is claire and he meets his new friend at a night at a party named elliot and elliot turns into like a good friend but it got it gets a little left rightish i don't want to say too much but to just like start off by saying um Alex True Love is known as Daniel Daniel Dahani. Da I'm gonna stick with that. And Claire is the girlfriend. It's Madeline Weinstein. Um, Elliot is Antonio Marzali. Tried. And um and then I'm gonna do his best no, where's his best friend? Sorry. His best friend's name is Daniel. Oh man, why'd I go for this? Daniel Zolgodari. Okay. So I'm just those are my four mains I'm just gonna stick with. So yes, yeah, basically he's trying to do this. Overall I rated the movie myself. A 2.5 to a 3 stars. It wasn't great. Yes, it did make me laugh. Even when um, there was a part of the movie that did make me laugh that I like recorded and sent to a couple of my friends that I thought was funny. That's usually what I do most times when I watch movies. And so um, that was that was it. Um, I don't know what else to say about this movie. I did laugh. It was an I movie. Those are the main characters. Um, my warning is for this is if you can't take um gays, lesbians, trans, this may not be the movie for you. Um maybe I'm trying to figure out if this is like you could watch this with kids. I depend I think it more depends on the age group you want to watch with kids for this movie. You can go for that. Um Well, time. It was this didn't touch any bases like on the kiss and booth or anything, which I didn't even do a video on because that movie was I loved it. Um, so the yeah, I'm trying to see if I could gather anything else for you guys for this movie released on June eighth. Thanks. Those were the main parts. Um, it was a night movie. I I really don't want to drag this out anymore for you guys. So. I mean, watch it, give it a try. If you agree, then you can let me know. If you disagree, then you can let me know. I just wanted to let you guys have watched the movie and what part of it, whatever. Um, yeah. So, really quick to last week's, um, not even last week, last videos, random question of the day. Honestly, truly. I didn't even put it up yet, so I didn't get any answers to see what people thought. But I don't know what to say about it because I really want you guys' opinion. Because me, if I'm in 35 and I see a 55 is on the way pretty soon, I start speeding up. Because, like, say someone's behind you, I'm going to speed up because I don't want the person behind me, like, 
hurry up. So I like slowly, but I don't, my trick is I go up to like 40, if I'm in 35, I go up to like 40, 42, like, you know, 45 is to push it. Then when I push to, um, when I get like past the 55, then I go my 55. But I'm just trying to figure out if I'm doing it wrong or right or I'm just am I just like getting lucky in life. So my next random question of the day. You should see I'm so out of it. I didn't even do my hand thing. So to the new random question of the day um, is. What was your favorite subject in high school? Or do you remember the teacher that made that subject your favorite? I said high school, right? To help you guys to help narrow it down. I'm going to say from 9th to 12th grade. 9th to 12th grade, what was your favorite subject? So guys, thank you for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe. The bell. <laughs> Have a good day. Thank you for watching.